Hello there, my name is Tom Skralo and welcome to my YouTube channel. So, you know, I've been thinking, sitting here in Latvia, it's quite a cold country, as you can see outside. It's not exactly the most uh, friendly of places in terms of the weather and uh, the sun is shining today, but usually it's a lot more, a lot colder and very dark and foggy and it's just depressing. So we were planning to move to Dubai in uh, April. But you know, I was just sitting there and uh, I was thinking, forget it. So let's just do it now. So uh, Sophia said uh, that uh, she's ready to move ASAP because it was, I think, uh, the night before today. And uh, it's around one o'clock in the morning. I just came to Sophia, I woke her up and I said, let's go to Dubai. And she was like, yeah, 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 okay, okay. Yeah, let's go, I'm ready, I'm ready to go. I think she comprehended the word Dubai and move. So she was like, yeah, fine, so let's do it. And uh, yeah, so just like that, I've the same moment at around 1.30 in the morning, I've just purchased uh, some plane tickets to Dubai one way. And uh, so we are leaving tomorrow. So we have about 24 hours to pack our shit, so to speak. Well, Sophia is overwhelmed. She doesn't understand what is going on. She's just sitting there doing absolutely nothing. Are you ready to go? Yes. Yes, you're ready to go. We are just... Uh, packing within 24 hours, and that's usually how Tom Scrollo does things. I don't like to plan things, you know, half a year in advance to do anything. I just, uh, usually I, I just plan sometimes some things and then just I decide, fuck it, let's do it like right now. So, and uh, the office is looking like with some boxes and everything is just being pulled apart, including my uh, trading station. It's not gonna be here anymore, so we're just pulling it apart and uh, preparing everything to be shipped. Some of the stuff we'll carry with us, some of the stuff will be shipped, just like, you know, all the mounts for the trading station and all the good stuff, some, something here will get sold, some, something will be shipped, all the boxes are being prepared. And uh, yeah, so basically we have 24 hours to pack everything, which is most important. For me, it's like the trading station and uh, the stuff like that. So uh, once we are finished with the packing, then we'll uh, meet our friends, just say our goodbyes, and uh, we'll come back to Latvia maybe in a few months, uh, just to you know pack the rest of the stuff, ship some maybe some furniture, take care of other things, and uh, sell Sofia's car, and uh, etc. So uh, for the time being. That's it, so within just one day, we decide, let's just move to Dubai, finally. Let's just finally do what we wanna do in life and just say, forget it to all the other small things that I was waiting to fix and get going so that I can go to Dubai peacefully. So forget about all of this. So just let's finish packing and let's just go to Dubai, finally. We have about two apartments that we are currently, will be looking at in a few days. Everything is set for the viewings, so we'll select the apartments right away. We'll move in and uh, send the address uh, to my assistant, who is gonna just ship all the boxes to that address in Dubai, and that will be it. So best of luck, and this is like a, a you know, the new style, of vlog style of us moving to Dubai, basically. So uh, let me know in the comments if that's something that you enjoy. So we are finished. Now the office looks a lot more boring and empty right now with the trading station being gone. So uh, it's gonna be shipped over to Dubai. <laughs> Dubai. Yeah, so basically I'll miss this place very much with all the pool, the pool table, some darts games and a nice penthouse view to Riga, to the capital of Latvia. And if you don't know the place, then Google it. So, it is the morning morning, it's about 4.30, so I have just like slept maybe two hours. I freaking hate those early airplanes, so it's, you know, almost never get any sleep. Sophie is shocked as well, but she's usually falling asleep a lot easier and faster than 
I do. Yeah, it's quite a lot of excitement, so I couldn't fall asleep all the planning for all the videos and the things I'll be doing in Dubai and, you know, the stuff that we'll be able to do since we actually moved to Dubai and we don't have any time restraints and, uh, yeah, so it's going to be quite awesome and uh, ready to have some breakfast, whatever that is left in the refrigerator and then taking off to the airport. So we are at the airport and uh, we had to undergo a second COVID test, which is that uh, quick COVID test. So Sophia got her second COVID test result. Are you good to go? Yes. <laughs> That's why we pay for business, just to get a free sandwich and some free cereal, uh, some free chips and some free rice. Right, well, time to fly, I suppose. So look at this, we actually got our suitcases this time. Isn't that a something? <laughs> this is just a mystery, like last time when we came here a few months ago, we actually uh, lost one of the suitcases and I had absolutely nothing to wear for like three weeks. So yeah, this is a blessing. All right, let's head to the hotel and just get some sleep. So we decided to go for a walk with Sofia, just to check out the place where we are gonna live tomorrow. It's about one o'clock in the morning right now. But tomorrow we'll have three viewings of three apartments. So that's gonna be quite interesting. Two of them will be in uh, one really cool tower and the other one, really big one, will be in the GBR. GBR is right there, those uh, beige looking buildings. But uh, yeah, so we'll just walk around Dubai Marina and the GBR here a little bit, enjoy one o'clock in the morning when nobody's here and uh, check out the tower before tomorrow and then head back, go to bed, wake up, go view the apartments, select one, sign the contract and uh, I guess move in. So after about an hour of walking around Dubai Marina in the GBR area, we finally made it to our potential next home, which is the Kayan Tower, Kayan, Kayan, whatever. So, uh, there it is. This is our potential next home, which will be, uh, we'll be taking a look at it tomorrow. So a beautiful, iconic building in Dubai Marina. Just bloody awesome, we can check it out. Let's research it on Google. It's a, uh, this famous spiral shape. And uh, we do think that it's gonna be a nice fit for us for the next year or two. So, good morning. Now it's about time we go and check the first apartment in the GBR. So, uh, yep, basically, there's the GBR. And that's where we are going, to the right. We just took a look at one of the apartments. It was a really, really nice one. And now we still have to take a look at another one at the Cayenne Tower, the one that we looked at last night at the building itself. So yeah, let's take a look at that one and finally make a decision. Like home. 
that's our new home. So we just signed the contract and we are official residents of the Cayenne Tower. So it's gonna take us about a week to actually move in because of all the formalities, all the documents and stuff, but uh, hell yeah. So we can, we can congratulate us on officially moving to Dubai. And uh, look at this place. It is just a dream come true. So the big job was completed. We found the apartment and uh, yeah. So uh, right now I think we're gonna relax a little bit and uh, in the evening we'll go to the gold sook. We'll check out some diamond watches because I was thinking to go into that diamond game. We'll see, maybe I'll go crazy. I've been no, but never a fan of ostentatious watches or you know diamonds or even gold you know some of my watches were gold but the one that the recent one that I've been wearing quite a lot is the Ulysses Nardan the Mariner rose gold but again it's on a strap so it's not exactly too ostentatious but uh, I was thinking since we're moving to Dubai to go a bit crazy Dubai style so I'm get myself an iced out Rolex or maybe an iced out AP so I'll go take a look at that and then we'll go to Dubai Mall and just walk around since in Riga everything was closed and here everything is open so we'll do some fun here with that and then yeah so this video is coming to an end please hit the like button really did my best to film that you know realistic uh, blog kind of a style of us moving to Dubai so uh, it will be part number two and part number three if we get a lot of likes uh, on this video it's gonna be a second part where uh, we're moving into the apartment and the part number three uh, will be about uh, buying a car so obviously we'll need a car here so we'll buy one or two cars and i was thinking maybe something sporty like maybe some lambo or some ferrari and maybe a g-wagon always wanted one maybe we'll go with the g g63 amg so something like this in a vlog style as well so let me know your thoughts on this something uh, not just sitting at the trading station and talking about trading and finances and investments so something a little bit more active so yeah, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.